sideline reporter Doris Burke. This is Kevin Hart. Earlier this season, it was Chicago coming away with the loss in this matchup against the Hornets. Yeah, not a very inspired performance for them, particularly when they were defending. They just gave that hostile crowd plenty to cheer for. Yeah, they allowed a lot of free runs to the hoop, a lot of open jump shots, and in the end, the opponent's shooting percentage was through the roof. You can't win if your defense isn't better than that. And a look at the starters for the Hornets. Zeller and Jefferson are inside. Kemba Walker is out there with Jeremy Lamb, and it's Batum in at the small forward. Two open that time made it look too easy. And how about that? Just an easy way to get on the board. And just like that, Greg, the first lead belongs to them. You know, and, and for Cody Zeller, after that promising rookie campaign, he, he just did not tear it up in year two. In fact, his production only improved slightly. But, but that was mostly due to the increase in playing time. Talented guy, no doubt, just still trying to find his way in the league. And for Cody Zeller, Greg, there's a reason he was the fourth overall pick back in 2013. He showed the size and athleticism to be a difference maker in college. And Clark, now he has to do it at the pro level as well, and I think people are pretty confident he can. Yeah, I'm agreeing with those folks myself because he does have the tools. It's now a matter of transitioning and becoming a little better shooting the ball than he's shown. Now here's Lamb. 11 points for him in that last game against New York. Yeah, not to mention the four big steals on the night, getting after it on both ends. And Jefferson gets it to go. Could be the first of a lot of mid-range jumpers that we see from him. Last game for Chicago, it was a loss to the 76ers in Philadelphia. You know, I don't like to use the word shock, but that was a shocking result for me. Nobody saw that one coming. To lose to that team was surprising enough, but to get blown out like that? I know. I mean, I'm with you there. It just seemed as though they were sleepwalking their way through that entire game. It was estimation just inexcusable no good from 11 feet and not the best shot right there with a good defender draped all over you i agree with you i mean not the shot they were hoping for but he can really cause problems with his defense lots of room jefferson can't get that one to fall the bulls have gone one of three for the field to start this one so far gasol kicks it to noah good ball movement here by the bull Finley. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. Chicago shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Yeah, a year ago, though, Kevin, 78% conversion rate from the free throw line, so that's a nice all-around effort. Yeah, they had the kind of success from the line that would make any coach breathe a sigh of relief, guys. The Hornets making a change here. Kaminsky's checked in. Guys, the Bulls' defense was as stout as ever last season. A big part of that is they have guys that challenge you inside and at the rim. Even off the bench, all of their bigs are mobile and protect the basket. Now here's Lamb, and the three ball is good. A good open look, and he splashes home the three. Rose against Walker. The cut side to Butler. At the elbow, it's Noah. It's deflected. Batum with the steal. Walker with it, and Rose picks him up defensively. Here's Lamb. And it's wide right. Hits off the rim. Talking about the Bulls and their rim protection. They had the lowest opponent field goal percentage on shots right at the rim. Yeah, and, it, and it helps when you compare seven-footers down low. It's not just the bigs, though. Even their perimeter players will track back and challenge at the rim. Really a total team effort. And, and I love the way he uses his size there to make sure he gets that goal. Dunleavy's shot is off. The bucket just not well protected, but still he doesn't convert too often. That's been the story with him. Lamb, good. Oh, Maestro, he is so good at making those lead passes. Like conducting an orchestra. To the paint. Here's Walker. Goes back up. Rose with the block. And 